about to leave already back in so this video is actually going to be one video and a series of videos surrounding coachella so if you're interested in all things festival subscribe to this channel so Today it is all about making a festival themed nail polish, which is something that I never thought I could actually do until now. When I personally think Coachella, I always think of style before I ever think about music. Don't come for me in the comments. Nail art is one of the most interesting ways to complete your head to toe festival transformation. So where did I get my custom fingernail polish made, you ask? It's a great question and I have a great answer. It's the nail brand called Orly, which has been around since like 1975. They are nail OGs. They just opened up a spot in LA. It's called the Orly Color Lab, where you or anyone you know can go in, you can make your very own custom color fingernail polish. Fingernail polish? <laughs> You can create your own custom fingernail polish, name it what you want, design it how you want. Like 13 year old me started crying as soon as I entered the room. Just made it to Orly Color Labs. This is Alex. Hi. She's gonna walk me through making my very custom Coachella polish. You can create your own custom color that's completely custom to you. You create it, we mix it for you. You also get to label it. It doesn't get more custom than that. Let's do it, come on. So the Color Lab scientist named Alex, she was so sweet. She walked me through this whole process and it really is super simple and surprisingly takes somewhere between three to five minutes to do, especially if you know exactly what you're looking for when you go in. The first step being to choose your mood. Whether you like bright or you want something nice, a little darker. Since Coachella's in the des, I feel like we gotta go with bright. So we have all of these really gorgeous photos as color inspiration. Okay. You choose you know, whichever photo kind of pops out at you that resonates with you, and that is step number two. So I actually came in with this photo from Pinterest that I already knew that I really wanted to try and recreate. I love the pearlized color. So having this as kind of like our guide was really super helpful for me in deciding exactly what I was looking for. I really like this purpley pink kind of mixed in color with like a shimmer added to it. I'm thinking we could go here because it has that shimmer pink effect. The lightest version of this color. So awesomely enough, this color already comes with a shimmer effect. And we're gonna add in the purple and the white pearl. Ooh, yes, give it to me. Then comes the hardest part, picking the name. There's so much pressure to pick the right name. I don't know, it kind of felt like this was my child and I was gonna set this color up for either success in its lifespan or failure. So I had to really make sure it was a good gender neutral name. After much deliberation and thought, Alex walked me through the process. I feel like I'm gonna name it Ferris Wheel. Thumbs up if you like that. By the time that you're weighing in, it's already done anyway. I don't know about you, but I used to mix my nail polish together when I was a kid to try and make my own custom color. So seeing all of these amazing bottles of colorful nail polish out in the open, it was almost a little too much for me to kind of behave like an adult. It was real hard. But at last, it came time to start mixing this stuff and I was so excited. Well, Alex just coated up, suited up. Ready? When you um, pick your custom color, it gets sent to us over here at the color bar and we get an exact ratio and recipe for you. There's Ferris wheel and it tells us exactly how to make it. For yours in particular, we are going to add the pearl to give it that effect that you wanted. Got it, because that's what I submitted as far as my inspo goes. Exactly, so that's why it's so much fun up here. Not only for us as mixologists, but we're really able to be as creative as possible and play around and mix around to get you that exact color and tone that you want. All right, let's get her started. I'm like so nervous. It's like I am having a baby. I wonder if she's gonna be pretty. And what I thought was really interesting is that while my recipe that I had created at the station did pop up, Alex was fully customizing it kind of based on the small color tweaks that I wanted to make. Is this the color that you wanted, babe? It's close. Mm -hmm. Did you want it to be lighter? A little more purple. A little more purple. Add some purple in there and see what happens. I think that's pretty close. 
should we close? Mm -hmm, what mm -hmm. do you think? I think we're pretty close, yeah. You put those little balls in there. Yes, so these guys, um, if your color ever separates, which nail polish kind of naturally does at a certain point, or if you haven't used it in quite a while, you just shake it up. How long does nail polish last? A long, long time. Technically about 32 months. It really can surpass that. Okay, great, because that's yeah. usually my style. I like to keep things for like decades, like okay, yeah. eyeshadows and things that you shouldn't keep. Mm -hmm. So the fact that I have a three year window on nail polish really is setting me up for success. We are gonna bottle her up. This is the magic up. moment. Pour her up. This takes talent, everyone. I was a bartender and making a pour without making a mess is really hard. Beautiful. I love her already. She's beautiful. Hashtag she did a great bless. Job. <laughs> Look at this gorgeous shimmer. Wow, yeah, you can't really see it on camera, but the shimmer is definitely there. Look at how gross my nails are, by the way. Like, they are in desperate need of Ferris wheel. <laughs> Alex, thank We're you so much. Oh. Not done yet. Wait. One second. What do you mean? You have to put your custom label on the bottom of this. <gasps> it will be so official. <gasps> no way. You already yeah. had it printed? This is so cool. I really want it. Can I do the honors? This is the moment. Ferris wheel's becoming official. Here she is. And. nail polish scientist. <laughs> I don't have my lab coat yet, but I'm gonna get one because they're really cute. Look at this lab coat. Ugh. And if you're watching this right now, I kind of know what you're thinking. You're like, oh wow, Erin, that must be nice for you because you live in LA. I don't have one of those near my house. Well, hold on because Orly Color Labs are working right now to try to get this online as well that you'll be able to custom make it via the internet. So if you have some FOMO happening right now, you need to take that comparison game and kick it to the curb because you're about to be able to make your own custom nail polish color really soon. At least they're working on it. Important to know if you ever want to stop by to get your own custom polish made, this is not a nail salon, so they don't have manicurists. They're available all the time to do nails. Occasionally, they'll bring in like an artist to do some like special look. So don't stop by hoping you're gonna get your nails done on the spot. So now that I had my Coachella inspired color, I decided that I did wanna go and see if I could get this Coachella inspired nail art actually done. This was a typical nail polish. They are working on ways to get gels made as well. So I'm just like really excited about the fact that this is a thing. Customized makeup is such a trend right now. It was only a matter of time before somebody jumped on custom nail polish. Let me know what you thought about this video and if you wanna see some more festival inspired content on this channel. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel and follow me on Instagram, you guys, and um, is there anything else? Comment on this video, like this video, thumbs up, share it with your friends. Ow, <laughs> hit my elbow. And since you're still here, you might as well click right here for another video on this channel and right here for another video on this channel. I'm not really sure what it'll be yet, but I'm pretty sure you're gonna like it if you clicked on this video. And uh, yeah, I'll see you next time. Bye! -bye.